Well, I suppose just like the Lovecraftian stories that they're trying to pull from, there's a lot of the unknown going into Doctor Strange 2. Now the director of the film Sam Raimi has confirmed one major aspect that relates to America Chavez. Just like the comics, yes, she is a multiversal character. So I don't think many people really suspected otherwise when it came to this, but again, I can see how some people are starting to get worried considering people are now really starting to understand that they are making some changes to Miss Marvel that are nothing like the comics, and they've done so more so recently than before, which I guess worried people. But again, America Chavez fans, I guess you should be happy as the director Sam Raimi did confirm that yes, she's a newcomer, yes, she has her powers, and yes, she is not from our world. He said she comes from another universe, and she's going to be somebody that stays around in our universe, meaning that just like the comics, they're going to follow the same template. Now, if you haven't read the comics, or you just don't care to, it's pretty much everything I just said. It's really that simple. She's born in another universe. That universe ends up going haywire, just like Miles Morales. They're both brought into our universe during the course of an event that took place. And then they're just kind of, a, you know, they're mainstays. They're just now here. And again, I understand why Sam Raimi has to answer these questions, even though to us they seem obvious. But I think many people are starting to question some of the decision making related to various things going on in the MCU. And certainly, I don't think you want to change a character like America Chavez too much because she's been around for only like a handful of years, right? If you start really butchering the character right out the gate and it's still fresh on people's minds, you don't have a lot to pull from or a lot to change to say, hey, well, this was done kind of before. You know, we look back at the whole Wanda and Pietro thing. Oh, they're not mutants. It's like they never were mutants. They were retconned to be mutants in the comics, but then they were X-Men. So you could look at that and go, well, okay, I accept the change because it makes sense. It was done in the comics. Chavez, like, she's literally been around for, I can recall the first issue. So like, it's still fresh on people's minds. So I'm glad that they're not going to stray too far away from it. And hopefully they just kind of, um, you know, figure out a way to do this with more characters down the road. I know some people have had issues with Mr. Knight, how he was displayed in um, Moon Knight, but... Not really for me. I think it's fine, you know. Suddenly, everybody's a Moon Knight fan, everybody. Ooh, where were you two years ago when his comic series got canceled because nobody read it? That's what I thought. <laughs>